Can you flip the switch in my earpiece? Thank you. And we'll have the supers. Thank you. Okay. I'll, I'll count down or you will. Wait, what did I do? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Fiddlesticks. Okay. Five. Now, the story of an Orange Beach boy with an extremely rare heart condition called hypoplastic left heart syndrome. Okay, here we go. Five, four. Now, the story of an Orange Beach boy with an extremely rare heart condition called hypoplastic left heart syndrome, also known as a broken heart. When Fisher Nelson's mother was 20 weeks pregnant, she learned the left side of his heart was severely underdeveloped and could not pump blood well. A crushing blow for parents realizing the life-threatening struggles their fourth and youngest child would face. That baby is now six years old. There's no cure for his condition, but it is currently stable thanks to medical advancements and the warrior spirit of this Gulf Coast family. Doing so good. Heart-wrenching cries from a child learning to walk again after his third open heart surgery. Come on, come get good. You can do it, come to me. This is Fisher Nelson, four years old, undergoing rehab at Texas Children's Hospital in Houston. There you go, there you go. At four days old, he underwent his first open heart surgery. Then another at five months with other surgeries in between. The Nelsons spend a lot of time traveling between Baldwin County and Texas, where Fisher's doctors just removed his feeding tube in December. A lot of people meet Fisher and they know Fisher, and they don't realize that he has a heart defect, and that uh, they don't realize how, how sick he really is. I can tell you when he's kept though. Fisher's condition keeps him from playing contact sports, but as you can see, he is always on the move. When I see Fisher, I see an adorable, beautiful child. I'll have the orange drink. May I have the orange drink? The red one is much better. Oh, the red one's much better? Okay, okay, I'll have the red oh, one. Oh, a purple. As his mother, when you see Fisher, what do you see and what Watch do you out. feel? I feel grateful when I see him. I, I, don't, I don't deserve, I don't deserve how well he's doing. And I just feel grateful and thankful. Fisher knows he has a special heart. He's small for six, but his stature is overshadowed by his big personality. What you got there? Waffle. A waffle. Chopping it half to you. Okay. <laughs> Fisher loves preparing food here at his grandparents' home in Orange Beach. He has other toys he plays with at what he calls his Houston home, where he goes every four months. There are bubbles way up high. There are bubbles in the sky. Mm -hmm. Loving this child is easy. Not having a cure nor a clear diagnosis for his rare genetic condition awesome. is not. Mm. What do you hope for him? Realistically, what do you see for Fisher? Our hope for Fisher is that he can reach adulthood and live a long, you know, full life. And I'm 45 years old, so if Fisher makes, you know, 40 more years and 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 outlives me and Pro, that's that's our goal. Fisher goes back to Houston in April. He's close to needing another intervention. Come on, come on, a little further and you can sit on my knee. His parents will keep pushing forward, helping him power through the pain as it comes. La, 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 la. <laughs> they choose to focus on the joys of life day by day 
and help promote research that may one day lead to a cure. You got this, buddy. You got this. My mission with the American Heart Association is just to bring awareness, to give people hope, and to raise funds so that Fisher can have a better quantity of life and a better quality of life, and others like him. And I just want to take something negative that we've been through and just try to bring something positive out of it. Fisher is this year's face of heart for the American Heart Association's 2023 Baldwin Art for Heart Gala in Orange Beach. Fisher will be there with his family. I'll be there too. WKRG is the media sponsor, so please mark your calendars for April 15th. You can find more information on WKRG.com. Thank you, ma'am. Encoder. Okay, thank you, thank you. Thanks.